hi guys you're welcome back to my youtube channel my name is divine and you're welcome if this is your first time stopping by this channel so in today's video i'm going to be teaching you how to make a simple kitchen apron and here we have the things the materials that you need you need your fabric you need your measuring tape your scissors your thread your pins and your tailor's chalk or you can use the normal blackboard chalk Okay, so for the length of our apron, I measured a length of 32 inches. Remember, I'm going to attach neck straps to this apron. So it's at the end, it's probably go it's definitely going to be more than 32 inches. But without the straps, I measured the length of 32 inches. And then for the width, I measured 24 inches and I folded it into two making it 12 inches and here i've already cut for the length and i'm going over for the width now remember i said that for the length i cut 32 inches and for the width 24 inches but it's followed over so it's 12 inches Now this is what we have here. So um on the neckline, I measuring I just measured six inches for the width and twelve inches for the length. Now I'm just trying to make a kind of armhole for the apron. So I'm measuring the six inches all the way down to the twelve inches. This is just so we can have a straight line to make our curve so here i just measured two inches from the bottom part of our six inches line and i'm just going to connect it from the 12 inches length that we have i'm just going to connect it all the way up i'm just trying to make everything perfect so there is no error now note how this i'm going to cut off from the path for you can as you can see in the video and not from the folded area you don't want to cut from the folded area because that is they're just going to spoil your apron so you cut from the other side and not from the folded part of the fabric Now I'm just going to cut out, I'm just going to cut it out and you can see how far our, you can see how far we are going. Now this is what we have here for our apron. So I'm just going to attach my bias tape. I'm just going to bias the two parts and then we're going to attach a pocket also to this fabric. Now we are going to measure out our pocket. And for the length of the pocket, I measured out 16 inches. Sorry, for the width of the pocket, I have 16 inches and for the length, I have 12 inches and it's 16 inches because the pocket, I'm going to divide it at the middle when sewn on the apron. So we have like two pockets. You're going to see what I mean by the end of this video. So just keep watching. So yeah, I'm just measuring the 16 inches width and 12 inches length and I'm just going to connect everything so they look perfect now note that the sewing the sewing allowances are also included in all of this so because we're not going to take much sewing allowances from them so i just added the sewing allowances to them 
so i'm just cutting out my pocket remember i said for the width of my pocket is it's 16 inches and for the length it's 12 inches now this is the pocket that we have here so i'm just going to go back to my sewing machine i'm 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 going to for the top part I will fold it into two like so and then I'm going to stitch it so it's very neat at the top part fold once by half inch and fold over again by half inch and then stitch it up we are going to sew the others but that will be on the main fabric that is on the apron so so for the straps i cut out two straps for the belt of the apron and for the neck band so for the straps of the belt i cut out 26 inches for the length and two inches for the width while for the length for the neck band i cut out 30 inches for the length and two inches for the width so like i sh like i like i can see um i'm just going to go ahead and fold it fold the two inches over and stitch by two in by just half an inch sorry and i'm going to do that for all of them for both the neck band and the belt straps now for the pocket i'm also going to fold over by half an inch that is for the top part i'm going to fold over like so so by half an inch and fold over again by half an inch and then i'm just going to sew it on our sewing machine remember i said that for the straps of the belt the length is 26 inches and two inches for the width and the, for the neck band i said that the length is 13 inches and the width is two inches you just have to fold over and sew in by half an inch And we're also going to sew the top part of the pockets of the apron by folding over by half an inch and folding over again by half an inch. And then we're just going to place it after folding the top part. I will place it on the on the bodies of the apron and i'm going to fold it and sew now for the neck part you can as you can see i already put my bias tape on the armpits of our apron i did it for the two sides of the apron and for the top part i just folded it in by half an inch and folded over again by half an inch and made a stitch on it now for the sides i did the same thing as i did for the top part i did the same thing for the two sides like you can see here and i also did it for the bottom part making everything to look nice and good now for the belt i already made a stitch of half an inch and so this is, these are the two belts. I already stitched them by half an inch by folding the two inches that I cut out and sewing, all, sewing it all by half an inch or you can use less than half an inch. And I made a small opening at one end. So I made, so from that one end that I left open, I'm just going to insert like a stick and turn it over to the other side. So our belts, and neck straps are neat. I did that for the two belts and for the neck straps. So for the for the pockets, I already went to my sewing machine and I stitched the the top part, and that is to make it look neat so i'm just going to go over to the fabric my main apron and i'm going to fold it over like so at the middle 
and I'm going to stitch it for the two sides I'm going to fold over like so and for the bottom part I'm also going to fold it over and stitch on my apron and that is it for the pocket and I'm also going to go ahead and make a straight line at the middle to divide our pockets now this is the end result of our apron looking all neat and fine so I went ahead to cut um, the next strap into two because I found out that it was kind of a little bit longer than I expected so I just cut it into two and it's also good like this because anybody can wear it any size can wear it comfortably so I cut it into two and folded a little bit of the fabric in and stitched the top part making this the next straps very neat now this is what we have here as the pocket looking all fine and neat so here we have two pockets one here and the other here we have to pocket you can easily insert your hand or put in anything that you want to put in when you are cooking or baking or barbecuing <laughs> now these are the straps of this beautiful apron you can go ahead and iron this apron to make it um nicer you can iron all the straps and the belts and that is it for making this apron please make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you end up enjoying it please make sure to comment down below and tell me what you like about this apron or any kind of apron that you'd like you'd like to see on my channel and also make sure to subscribe thank you